Oh my god, guys, was that really necessary? Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking this video today. You're here with your girl Rose, and today we're doing a react to season three of Attack on Titan. Now, for all those who are new, welcome. Thank you so much for clicking this video today. And for all those who follow me regularly, welcome back. Thank you so much. I always appreciate all your support. Now, as I said, we are doing a react to season three. Now, just a quick recap with what happened in the last episode. We saw Captain Levi take on the Beast Titan, and he was so close to defeating the Beast Titan, but another sentient Titan came up from behind and took the Beast Titan away just before Captain Levi could take the final blow. And also, in the last episode, we saw our beautiful Iron Man not make it. He sacrificed himself so that the Colossal Titan could be beaten, and that way we could retrieve Bertolt. I was so sad at the end of the episode, guys, because as most of you know, Iron Man was one of my favorite characters. I guess because with Attack on Titan in season one, so many people haven't made it. And so I guess I kind of knew that some people would not make it in this season. And unfortunately, Iron Man didn't make it and I'm really sad and I'm upset, but I kind of also saw it coming. But anyway, Let's get to today's episode. Hopefully, Sasha survived the blow that she received in the previous episode from the Armored Titan. Last week, I was so mad and so sad at the same time. I feel like, you know, at any point, could he not have just left? Oh, and we also saw Commander Owen fall off his horse. Now, I do strongly believe that he actually is still alive. Because right at the very end there, you saw that determination in him come back. You know, he's like, I have to find out that truth. And so I feel like he's probably severely injured, but still able to find out the truth. Yeah, you should have known this, Aaron. Oh, okay. So he had no other choice but to actually trust and believe Ironman. Come on, don't tell me that you didn't have some little inkling. Oh, there's that sentient titan. Who's got the beast titan on him? Oh my gosh. Is he coming after Bertolt? He seems so shocked. Is he shocked at what's happened? They did not expect this of humanity. Where's Captain Levi? Wasn't Captain Levi also chasing him? He knows Aaron Yeager. I guess he would know because Reiner and Bertolt would have told him that Aaron was the coordinate. Oh, he knows Aaron's dad. Oh my God. You know what he's going through. Did his mom also get eaten by a Titan? And did his dad sacrifice himself for the Beast Titan to be able to turn back into a human? Oh, okay. They're both victims of your father. Mr. Jaeger, what did you do? This just goes back to my original question. Is Mr. Jaeger a good guy or is he a bad guy? Who are you, Mr. Jaeger? Oh shit, it's Captain Levi! Oh my god, he's coming for you. Beast time, I would run if I were you. Oh man, Captain Levi is so mad. <gasps> is he tired? Is that why he fell? He must be exhausted. You made a promise to Commander Owen, Levi. You coward. Oh my god, Captain Levi, you are in no shape to chase after him. <gasps> Iron Man is still awake. Oh my god, guys, he's still alive. Oh my god. Iron Man. Guys, we finally got him. We got Rhino. Hmm, yes, what is in that tin? Oh, maybe, yeah, you're right. Maybe it was suicide pills. Oh, okay. It's a letter from Ymir because it's meant for Krista. Rhino. Yeah, because Historia is the queen now. And we can't just go giving the queen anything and everything. It could be a bomb. Although I don't believe it is a bomb. But we never know. Did you guys just see John's reaction? I like Hanji, but I also know that Hanji likes to get to the truth of things. Even if that means torture. 
I really hope she does not do what she did to Sawney and Bean to Rhino or Bertolt. Oh, good idea. We might be able to steal his power. Good point. I think Jean still really cares about Rhino. Oh, I feel like that's not even like a better fate for Rhino. Because obviously if you inject someone with that Titan ability to be able to steal that ability from Rhino, the person would have to eat Rhino. What do you mean you don't think all the conditions have been met? I mean, technically, Rhino's arms and legs have been severed. We just got to find somebody who's on the brink of death and then just inject him with the serum, right? Just because you don't know what's happened to Captain Levi doesn't mean you should take it upon yourself to kill Reiner. I mean, he's still a valuable asset. I feel like Hanji is just mad and she's letting her emotions get the better of her in this situation. Yeah, because normally Hanji is the first one to want to figure out the truth and if you cut off his head, you won't find out anything. Exactly, I agree with Sean. This isn't like you, Hanji. Exactly. If you kill Rhino, how are we ever going to figure out the truth? Oh, she wants Mikasa to fill up her gas and get the injection from Levi. What does Hanji plan to use with that injection? I thought Captain Levi was the only person who could make that decision on who to inject it into. Because you care about Rhino, Jean, as much as you try to suppress your emotions, you still care about Rhino. Oh my god, Mikasa's there now. Armin is still breathing. Oh my god, are they going to inject Armin? He's literally on the brink of death. Surely they're going to inject Armin. Mikasa's actually upset. Is Captain Levi going to give it to Armin or is he going to hold onto it for Commander Owen? Oh my god, watch out, Hanji! Oh my god! Oh my god! Guys, the Beast Titan is still running around within the walls. Seriously, can somebody freaking knock him out already? No, he wants Rhino. <gasps> they got Rhino! Exactly, you have no gas left, Connie, and there's no way you could take them on. You just end up getting killed. And we don't want any more deaths. I was going to say the decision was Hanji's. It was always Hanji's, Jean. Seriously, you might have swayed her a little, but in the end, she made that decision on her own. Oh my god, Captain Levi, is he going to give it to Eren? Oh my god. No. Oh my god, guys. No, 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 no. I freaking knew it, guys. Who will Captain Levi choose? Unless Command Owen comes to and actually says, don't pick me. I feel like Captain Levi would choose Command Owen. Oh my gosh. That guy was very brave to grab Commander Owen and bring him back. I told you guys, I knew it. He would use it on Owen. Oh my God, what's he going to do? Oh my God, guys. Would Mikasa actually take Captain Levi on? Armin is so clever, but then again, so is Kamen Owen. Oh my god, this is so hard. But I just feel like Armin hasn't completely lost his humanity. Exactly, because he was also considering that Commander Owen might be alive. Shut up, you! Exactly! He is the reason you saved trust. He was the only one who could reach Eren. Not even Mikasa could reach Eren. Exactly! He's the one who revealed Annie's identity. Not even Commander Owen knew who it was. He was the one who found Rhino. Lastly, and most importantly everybody, he is the one who defeated Bertolt. Oh my god, Mikasa, seriously slap this guy. They're both so valuable to humanity. I just hate that we're in this freaking boat. But I also believe that, you know, if we did choose Araman, I don't think he'd want to be revived, knowing that he ate Bertolt. I knew he saved Hanji. I knew it.
you know, it makes me really sad as well, guys, that Bertolt is going to die as well. I know Bertolt did the wrong thing, but he was also a kid when he, they recruited him. <laughs> Who is Captain Levi Goldinger? <gasps> Oh my god, Command Owen. Oh my god, he gave it to Araman. <laughs> oh my god, guys, was that really necessary? It was you guys who needed it. I agree. It's time to let him rest. He carried so much on his shoulders. Oh my god. I just don't know how Armin is going to take this. I really don't think he would be able to forgive himself. Armin. Alright guys, so that was the end of today's episode. I am thankful that Captain Levi chose to save Araman, but part of me also feels like he's not going to be okay with it. And he has such a gentle heart, and knowing that he ate Bertolt and killed Bertolt, I know that's going to weigh on his conscience. I really hope that Araman will be okay in the coming episodes. And I'm really sad that Command Owen didn't make it. But I'm really glad that he's been put to rest as well. Because he has had to carry so much. And be that devil for everybody, for humanity. Let me know in the comments below what you liked about this episode. I hope you really enjoyed this episode today, guys. I did. And I hope to see you all next time. Bye.